What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back, and guys, today we are going over so market we're talking about the market we're talking about how the market's starting to rise um we're, we're, made, we're gonna make so much mc guys if you are new to the channel make sure to sub it up comment down below it will be appreciated man uh we're on the road to 13 14 000 subs so all the likes all the everything will be appreciated so yeah um have you guys have you guys got into what's it called yet uh i can't even think what am i gonna say have you guys gotten the why can't i speak think Oh, have you got the glitched market yet? Um, because I have yet to get it yet. Um, I don't know why. It's kind of hard to get it. Has any of you guys got it? Um, uh, because me so far, I have not got it yet. Um, but going over the market, man. Um, Giannis dropped a lot. He was at around 550s at three something. Um, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, in which I got for 470, is now around 530k. So huge w's right now man um the dark matter is definitely they're pretty up there um only one that's going to continue to drop is d rose because i really wouldn't i wouldn't buy derrick rose i think chris paul opal's better than that d rose um and honestly right now man this is pretty cool stuff i'm not gonna lie like this is pretty cool stuff happening right now um the market is like not crash it's starting to rise and all my investments that i did invest in has are going up um perfect example is lamar odom malik Sealy. Um, those investments are very, very good right now. They're starting to go up big time. Paul Pierce and Iguodala, another one. If you did invest for around like 60 something K, they're they're up. They're up to 80 something K. Um, so you can make some good money if you guys invested. If you guys listen to me, this is pretty fire. Um, not only that, man, Giannis continues to drop that Galaxy with Giannis. I don't know why. I think if you get him for 300, he'll definitely go up. Um, probably the best card in the game, I think. I think he, him and Kareem together is almost, in, it's its literally impossible to stop them together. So, I don't know. Um, right now, I think the best snipe filters, as you guys saw, is my top snipe, fil top snipe filters video yesterday. The top snipe filters are definitely by far, like I said, man, Amethyst and Pink Diamond Chivas, bro. I'm not going to lie. This is the best snipe filter ever. Honestly, Clem Hawkins is not a bad price for 1200 Boris Dion for 1250. I'm buying that. I don't know why it was up there for so long. That, that's a snipe. Um, uh, but yo, the amethyst filter is straight cash, boys. You just gotta rock the amethyst filter. Um, it's just money. It's just moolah. So I definitely recommend this filter. This is an investment filter. It's definitely fire. And also, if you guys do need MT, hit me up. I am buying and selling MT. Uh, 1100 for J Rich. It's literally a hundred more then quick sell value so i i don't know i like putting my maximum bid or maximum buyouts around 1200 1300 that's what i like to do i don't know about you guys but guys right now is the market crash is the market up i'm going to tell you right now me personally some cards i would invest in if you guys didn't invest yet you're stupid a uh, perfect example this hardened was 170 on friday guys just sold for 218 only thing is, man, I don't really like investing in bid cards, but I invest in some cards. Some cards I invested in. I'll show you my collection. Um, so many amethysts, bro. It, it, it's the list goes on and on. I got some Lamar Odoms. Got some of my collection. Uh, we got another Lamar Odom. We got a Malik Sealy. And uh, yeah, this is pretty much what I invested. Pippin. I also bought a Chris Paul. I also have Giannis and Kareem. So, um, I think my investments are looking pretty good so far. On the J Rich end, the Clem Hawkins, they're definitely going to be a little bit... They're going to take some time to go up. Um, they'll probably be like 2500 within the next week or two. Because um, I don't expect Super Packs to come out anytime soon, honestly. And we didn't even get new XP today, so... Uh, pretty interesting stuff. I'm going to have to grind this XP. Win a game which will threat. Pretty interesting. But, uh, yo, right now... Um, now might be a time to sell your cards. They might drop Super Packs tomorrow. I don't think they will... Um, but another card, if you guys didn't realize, bro, Larry Bird was really cheap as well. Um, Larry Bird was around 100k, 110k. This card's probably gonna end up selling for 160 not too long from now. Uh, I know there is a lot up here, but trust me, man, the market's really going up. It's starting to go up. It's pretty cool. Um, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, man, he should keep going up. He's like OP as hell. I, I literally can't believe how OP this card is um he's literally on steroids i i can't believe it i literally played limited with, if, if you guys have kareem and you play limited with kareem oh my god it's not even fair it's literally not even fair and he can get deep threes so 
Yeah, this Kareem is literally something else. Um, I definitely would recommend start try to snipe Dark Matters, man. Chances are you're not gonna get a Dark Matter snipe. Like 110% not gonna get Dark Matter snipe. But yo, it's worth a try. If you get it, if you if you do it, you make so much MT. Um, like sniping on a Kareem or a Giannis, I would love that. That would be absolutely incredible. And another card I would like to talk about. Um what is his name? I can't even think. Galaxy old Tracy McGrady, man. Um, this card, this card is very, very slept on still. Um, for like 250, I would say around 250k, man. This card is still insane. Look at his defense. This card's still great, still goaded. He has a 96 speed. He's literally insane. He's deep threes. Um, so this card's still insane. So if you really want to make that upgrade, it's up to you. This card is still absolutely crazy. Um, amazing card. So I think this is my next pickup. I think Galaxy will T Mac. Um, you could probably get a very good price on him. Uh, he was even cheaper the other day. The Opals were at an all-time low yesterday, and that's probably what's going to happen next market crash as well. Um, that's what's going to happen. There's just going to be a market crash, another market crash, another market crash, and another market crash. This is where Endgame begins. Endgame begins. There's probably going to be a March Madness, um, thing this week. Probably going to be a March Madness thing with Lamella Ball Opal. I would love a Lamella Ball Opal, and I think all you guys would too. Um, I think this week coming up could be a big market crash, even though they did release some fire in Season 6. I think Season 6 is absolute money, you're not gonna lie. Like, what they did so far was straight cash. So we're gonna see, um, what exactly they do do. Um, but right now, I don't know if it's a good time to sell. Now, honestly, no. If you do wanna sell your cards, you wanna make MT, it's not a bad time to sell. But, your Amethyst and whatnot. All the players you invested in, not so much. Uh, my investment, I told you guys to invest in, was Malik Sealy. Got him for around 11k. Let's see what he's going for now. And uh, he went up a lot. So, got him for 11.12. He is at 15.4. And then after that, he might be at 16+. plus. Um, so, Malik Sealy is at 16k now, guys. So, if you did invest, it did turn out to be good. Um, shout out to the hater on my video. He said it wouldn't go up. Well, you're a nerd. And it did go up. Lamar Odom got him for around 35 30k the man's at like 46 but there's not a lot up here and earlier this morning he was at 54 um so after this man this is pretty interesting the market is definitely very very interesting um not only that there's not a lot up here like once these sell you're gonna make a lot of MT I can sell my Lamar Odoms to make like 7k 8k per um so this is pretty interesting man Lamar Odom was a key investment I hope you guys did invest in him and um all the amethyst man the amethysts are starting to go up. The market's rising a lot. And yo, that's really all I got for the video. I just wanted to go over the investments, all the investments that I made that you guys should have made and I told you guys to make. So uh, yeah, that is all we got for the video. And yes, have a good one, boys. Stay tuned for more content. Have a good one. Peace.